Have you ever wondered what it would be like to see Daniel Radcliffe reprise his role as Harry Potter, fighting Voldemort once again in a movie adaptation of Harry Winton of Potter and the Cursed Child? While this idea has been floating around for some time, it remains just a tantalizing fantasy. Most of us come and recently a trailer concept for The Cursed Child has been making waves, uh, suggesting a 2025 release date. This trailer cleverly combines clips from the original Harry Potter films, Anya Radcliffe's other notable performances, creating a compelling narrative about a haunted Harry on a mission to find his child, with Voldemort looming ominously in the background. Uh, however, it's important to note that this trailer is not an official release. The original Harry Potter cast, including Daniel Radcliffe, has expressed little interest in returning to the event as part of Unvoter's second cast, have been completely recalling from return, and had the active membership in politics. Uh, mm -hmm. Moreover, uh, Warner Brothers Discovery, uh, the, the studio behind the Harry Potter films, seems to be focusing on the Fantastic Beasts franchise and uh, an upcoming Harry Potter TV series rather than a Cursed Child movie. The TV series will feature a new cast offering a fresh start for the franchise in a different format. Um, so, so while the idea of the Cursed Child movie is thrilling, it's unlikely to happen anytime soon. But who knows? Maybe one day we'll get to see Harry, Hermione, and Ron back on the big screen, fighting new threats in the magical world of Hogwarts. Until then, we can only dream and rewatch the original films. Uh, by the way, did you know that Harry Potter's first broomstick, the Nimbus 2000, was designed to resemble a manta ray? Uh, just a, a fun fact to keep in mind that next time we're discussing Harry Potter trivia. You know, with that said, thanks for watching and stay tuned for more exciting content.